Every Sunday, Lars receives a visit from his daughter Mia. Just the sight of him at the window makes her eyes shine, as the visit is usually the highlight of her week. As she walks up those steps to knock on the door, she leaves behind the problems of the outside world to focus on the face that greets her, which makes her own face fill with complete happiness. She returns without hesitation every week to look into those eyes, as blue as Rigel, the brightest star in the constellation of Orion, and to receive that welcoming hug, which fills her with the warmth of a thousand galaxies. Lars's apartment is her refuge from the complexities of life, the complexities of work-related stress, the complexities of friendships and relationships, and a place where she can be a child to her father again. It is irrelevant what they do while they are together, as just his presence is enough to brighten her mood. She never has to worry about being her true self, knowing that her father will love her for who she is, not for someone she sometimes pretends to be. For her, it's so important to have someone to explain how life works, someone to trust completely, someone on her side, and someone to listen when things don't work out, to transform tears into mere drops of saline water, to infuse her with unconditional love, and to transform despair into serenity. Knowing that he's watching over her makes her feel so protected. While listening to his comforting voice, she remembers her idyllic childhood when she was free from the responsibilities of adult life. Completely relaxed, she is able to fall into a deep sleep, forgetting all her mistakes, her worries and problems, being totally at peace and free to dream in tranquility. Her father loves playing the ukulele and the sounds of the strings stir her emotions while singing binds them together in total harmony. Lars is also a great cook. Sometimes she wonders if there is anything he cannot do. He is even popular with her friends and boyfriends who often comments that they wish they had a father like him. Funny, witty, a great storyteller, and always an initiator of interesting conversation. Lars shows his love for Mia in many different ways, sometimes surprising her with gifts for no reason. The attention he shows her makes her feel special and his calm presence makes her feel loved. And as he attaches a necklace, she catches a whiff of his cologne, the same brand he has always used since he first carried her in his arms as a baby. Just feeling his touch makes her feel connected to him, knowing he will always be there to take care of her. Having a loving parent watching over her as he does makes her feel... Ugh. And when it's time to leave and she glances back at him, she knows that he is the perfect father. But Lars is not the perfect father. Because Lars does not exist. Mia's real father abandoned her when she was a baby. But that doesn't stop her from dreaming. Dreaming and looking up towards the sky, imagining the ideal father she never had. Looking over her and taking an active interest in her life. And even though not physically present, still sharing in every step of her life.